Well, it certainly can be argued that to be successful in America, you need to graduate from high school. But our next guest has proven that you don't have to wait for a diploma to launch a very successful business. Joining us to talk about wild wood pins, Nick and Sweeney. He's the founder, master craftsman, and woodworking teacher. And congratulations. Thank you. My goodness. Start by telling us a bit about your business. It's called Wild Wood Pins. Yes. Uh, wild Wood Pins um, exists to serve customers uh, with some beautiful wooden and acrylic pens. Um, I, I handcraft them out of exotic wood from all throughout the world. They're beautiful. That's a great 30 second elevator pitch, by the Thank way. Thank you. <laughs> Very nice. <laughs> what motivated you or inspired you to start a business? Uh, my grandfather was a woodshop teacher for 20 years. Um, when he retired, his friends got him a lathe. And on that, he showed me how to make pens. And I thought that was so much fun that I decided to uh, get a lathe for myself. And it's beautiful. Make a make pens. That's is that your grandfather that right there? That is my grandfather right yes. there. Yes. Hey, I want to back up just a bit because okay. I forgot to ask you how old you are. I am 17 years old. You're 17. And what grade are you in? I am a senior in high school. I will have my AA in business uh, this uh, summer. Wow, I am so impressed. Can you just Thank come you. over to my house and hang out with my kids? Um, I, I, don't know if it, I don't know if it's contagious. <laughs> Let's hope it is. I have a 16 and 13 year old. That would be awesome. Okay, show me your pens. Uh, so this uh, this is olive wood. Uh, this pen is olive. That's beautiful. Um, yes. Um, this is actually a, one of my favorite types of pens. It is a uh, bolt action pen. It works by advancing the uh, ink cartridge by pressing oh. and that's advancing gorgeous. Yes. And you made all of this by hand. I did, yes. You're so impressive. Thank you. Where can I get a hold of these pens? Uh, my website, wildwoodpens.com.co is uh, the best way to order them. And how much do they run? Um, 40 to $80. Very nice. This would be a wonderful present for someone that uh, graduation, mm -hmm. Father's Day right around the corner. This would be a great present. You can go to wildwoodpens.com.co. It's wildwoodpens.com.co. An important part of your success is the opportunities and education provided by the Young American Center for Financial Education. So talk about your experience with them. Well, first of all, I don't want this to sound like a commercial, but it, it, it might come out like that for That's young okay. Americans. That's uh, okay. I, I was involved with them. Uh, the very first time um, that I got involved with them was with their uh, Young Ameritown program. Mm -hmm. um, that was when I was eight years old, I believe. And hmm. then that, that Christmas, I got involved in their Young Entrepreneurship program and their uh, Christmas Marketplace. And that, that year, I was nine years old at the time, I sold almost $900 worth of pens. Oh and my gosh. That's when I decided that my pen business was no longer a hobby, it is now an actual business. An actual business. Yes. You're a businessman. I, I guess, yes. At eight years old, did you know, hey, this is what I want to do in my life, that's why you joined them? Um, uh, with Young Americans? Uh -huh. um, yeah, they, they've been a great resource for me. Um, I, I honestly can say that I would not be anywhere near where I am today without Young Americans. Who is your favorite entrepreneur and why? Um, my favorite entrepreneur would probably have to be uh, Rockefeller just because wow. he he had such a big dream um, and he really, he, he, he moved mountains to get to, uh, to get to his And dream. that's your goal? Yeah, yes, and I hope to be like him at some point. I bet you will. You already have that um, determination and that mm -hmm. drive, that motivation. So what do you think is your next move? Are you going to continue with your pen business and go to college or just focus more on the pen business? So as I, as I said, I've uh, been going to college. I'll have my AA degree this summer. So right. I've been at, in college for two years. Um, and I've been running this business along with my two other businesses um, at the same time and attending high school. So I, I feel that it should, I should have no problem running. Uh, oh, look at running you. This. Good for you. I'm so proud of you. And you know Thank who you. else is proud of you? Your mom and dad. Come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. Come on, you guys. Hurry, hurry. I have like 20 seconds. Get over here. So uh, your grandfather <laughs> was your inspiration, but your mom and dad, uh, they actually play a huge role oh, in your Oh, absolutely. Don't they? Absolutely. My grandpa lives in uh, California, and uh, so we get to see him quite often. Aww. But uh, so it's... It's, it's nice to have uh, such a good support team here. Oh my gosh, you're just, I just want him to hang out with my boys. <laughs> and I want to pinch your cheek with your joke joke. Oh, sorry, I shouldn't do that, right? <laughs> young American Center for Financial Education offers a statewide youth business competition for young people ages 6 to 21. Finalists and winners receive cash prizes and winners are paired with a successful Denver business person to help mentor and guide their business growth. Apply by June 5th at yacenter.org. That's yacenter.org.